Hello, and welcome back to Grimrock. Uh, some of you may be surprised to see me back here. It's funny, actually. This is going to coincide neatly with um, <laughs> the day... It's going to air the day after the uh, a, a rather tonally similar episode or set of episodes of uh, Banner Saga, <laughs> where uh get a bit of a new lease on the game. Um, that remains to be seen whether this is quite the same, but uh, at the end of the last recording session where I was quite frustrated with the game and um, it broke on me, um, I actually did discover what I intended to discover, which was how to use the console properly. I still don't totally get it, but it, I made it work. What I did for myself and for my own sanity is I just gave myself enough points to uh, level out the skill level in each of the um each of the weapon skills at least for these two i don't think i did it for yeah i didn't touch the other two i don't think um but i might <laughs> depending on how how this episode and the following episodes go um i think that's more than fair for uh, the sake of, hey, random, the fact that you randomly get items, um, or at least if you haven't run the dungeon before, you don't know where the items are and you don't know what you're about to get, so you don't know what you're going to be able to use. So anyway, um, I re-equipped um, uh, Mork with the Flail, um, because that is now the best mace item, and then... Uh, I specced Kontar into axes, so now he can use the axe instead, um, which should theoretically give us a total overall damage output improvement. Um, I'm trying to remember. I don't think I made any other edits. Uh, I was considering whether to make additional tweaks for... Did I do that in the last episode, or did I do that? I don't think I did that off screen, because it was only like, there's only like three minutes between the last, the save before I quit recording and the save that I loaded today. So I don't think I did that. Um, but anyway, there it is. Uh, so yeah, I no longer have that massive evasion penalty, but it doesn't make me very evasive. Uh, still no, un I still have no understanding of what a negative evasion actually means, if anything. It probably does, and the game just won't tell me, but it's neither here nor there. Anyway, um, let's trade these out. Just cause. And let's create a new save file, just cause. And then let's, um... Let's give this another go. I don't know. Let's see how these, how we fare against the lizards now. Now that we're a little bit better prepared. Of course, they come out to greet us immediately. Okay, so, still taking a lot of damage. Uh, interesting. Alright. Well. Uh, what shall we do? Um. Problem is, I don't have a lot more protection I can give. Like, at this point, um. Did I drop all that extra armor I believe so I don't have anything with higher armor values um, put you this on you real quick while I'm thinking this through and talking it out um, yeah funny that the mage is dragging along all the boxes um, need some food to pass around we can okay we're doing okay 
Um, but I don't have a lot of additional protection I can do. However, I could start specking in to more of this stuff and just cheese the stat points even more. Um, put three more in and get 15 health. Uh, what even is my health value? 167, so I'm not... Um, yeah. Oh, you know what I was going to do, actually? Hold on just a second here. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I can make this work without breaking the game. Um, I mentioned in the last episode that uh, when you have minotaurs carry skulls, Um, oops. Hmm. Well, that either didn't work or... Hold on. Am I doing that right? I think I have the wrong page up again. Oh, well. Whatever. I might fix that later. Uh, I've been skipping out on the skulls, and if I had known about that racial feat uh, the entire time, I probably um, would have been paying more attention <laughs> to that. Um, but yeah. We may get there later. Okay, um, let's just save again, because... We're about to get murdered by lizards again. Oh, it did work. It just went over there. Okay, so if I have this right... Yep, so... You'll have to forgive me for this. I think that's about how many skulls I've played with and then bypassed. Um, if you don't think that's fair... I, I honestly I don't care um, so uh, we'll save again should up my damage output a little bit the fact that they're so sneaky is the worst part fuck you speaking of Taking a nice sweet time. That was weird. Why did it... It missed a couple of times, or it appeared to. Huh. Well, that worked out in my favor. Um, just barely survived that encounter. But, hey, it's progress. Technically. I do wonder if there's a different way. I hope these aren't infinitely respawning. Oh, that's right. There's this whole thing. Uh, I don't want to do this. Hold on. Yep. Okay. There we go. Okay. Back where we need to be. Um, is it safe? It should be reasonably safe out there, right? <laughs> Good thing I saved. Um, huh. Well, let's put this back on you. I didn't really consider just how much slower this axe is than the sword. It is, isn't it? Yeah, it's like half the speed. Um, in theory, shouldn't be that big a deal if I can get in the right position, but that's a...
questionable. Uh, questionable thing. Turn around. <laughs> oh man I just don't like what are you supposed to Is they, do they have a weakness I don't know about is that the deal I just want to get inside. I can't even get inside. I mean, I've said it before. It's just like... I just want to have some fair combat, but it feels like all I can do is cheese. Because I don't have the damage output to kill anyone fast, and I don't have the defensive capability to soak a lot of hits. I mean, under any circumstances. And there's so many of them, that even if I can get in a good position, it doesn't last very long. Fuck me. <sighs> well, let's think about this for a minute. Um, hold on. Don't you have a bag? Give him a bag. Give him a bag for his skulls. Bag Full of Skulls is the name of my rhythm and blues band. God damn. I mean, what... I feel like I'm missing a mechanic. I really do. Like, I'm just not getting something. Or that I'm supposed to be dramatically more leveled up, and I don't... I should, you know, I should go watch somebody else's footage and see what level they're at. I mean, in fairness, in fairness to the game, I'm not exactly using the leveling system, uh, which is not helping me. But even when I do use it, it feels like, I mean, I used it suboptimally. I've spent more, technically at this point, I've spent more, more uh, points than I've earned. Just go for it, yeah. Um, let's see, I could put four more points in there and get 10 health. Or I could put more into athletics, which I think is going to pay out more in the long run in terms of how I want to spec him. Um, and I do have 20 points to spend on him. So. Let's go for it. That's a pretty substantial upgrade. Let's see if it makes a difference. I mean, do I have to... Is this not a game with builds? Do I need to spec into... Athletics for Mork just to make his... his uh, make him more um what do you call it evasive because there's not anything else that's gonna hold on is 
there something else that's going to give me evasion somewhere else? I mean... Yeah, way up the armor tree. Oh, doubles evasion bonus of equipped shield. That's interesting, actually. Huh. Okay. Versus... I mean, I'm not getting... Hold on. What is evasion derived from again? Dexterity, equipped shields, and other gear. So... My dexterity is 7. My shield is 7. Sure, that math makes sense. Um... And that's evasion plus two on the... Wait, so does my... Hold on. If I remove these, what is my evasion? My evasion is zero without my gear. Alright, let's have them change trade shields just so in case I forget further on that uh, I get that bonus with the armor upgrade. Okay. Uh, I might as well put these points in now to get plus two protection. Yeah, that's just armor. It doesn't hurt. Um, huh. Well, I mean, that's interesting. I probably should have taken a closer look at the skill tree. It, I mean, this is not a... It's a very old school interface. It's. It'd be nice to have an actual skill tree of sorts, right? This is very divergent, very old school, the kind of thing that has sort of fallen by the wayside. Um, not that there's anything necessarily wrong with that, but tend to fall by the wayside for good reasons. Anyway, um, so let's make someone else carry something. Forty-two, thirty-seven. Wait, what? Oh my God! If they're not, oh, wow. Okay, can't carry your skulls in a bag. That'll show me. <laughs> oh boy. Put the weapons in the bag. This, uh, that's a burnt out torch, so we'll put these in the bottom. Uh, I should just throw that away at this point, probably. I could swap this back in, but... Just seems silly. Why is my phone blowing up? I'll check up. I'll check in in a second. Um. Okay. You've still got a bunch of points. Let's see. How should we... I think the reach attack is a really a really big improvement for her. But she's still got relatively low damage output. Although her accuracy is very good. I just don't... I don't even know if that matters, right? On some level. 
your accuracy. You can't get more accurate than 100%. And this is not a percentile. It's random nebulous value. So um, let's at least give her some extra strength. Uh, or... This is for all melee. This is specifically for daggers. Well, I don't see... Hold on. It says melee, but frankly, I don't even necessarily believe that. It might be for all weapons. Um... I don't know that it changes my feelings on it, though. Uh, if I put all my points in here, I don't get any more strength, but I do get piercing strike. Pierces through enemy armor. I don't know who or what has armor. Do these things have armor? They've got scales. That seems like it should count as armor, but I don't know what they're... Armor isn't even a thing. The game doesn't even use that term. It uses protection. So is it literally referring to physical armor? Is it too much to ask to have this clarified? Um, let's at least do that. Let's see. Put a point into dodge. Might as well get the evasion plus five. Um, just for those chant times when we get caught out of, out of position. Um... And then let's put, uh, oh, I only have seven, not eight. I mean, at least getting the, I uh, put one too many in and there's no subtract, but um, at least to get the energy increase. Okay, that's not bad. Let's take another crack at this now that we've healed up a little as well. seem very fair. Okay. Everybody just wants a bite of Mork for some reason. I mean, he doesn't... It's not that it, I, I can't look at them all at the same time, obviously, but it's not just that they're... It has to be that they're just targeting Mork, right? It's not that Kontar's getting hit too, but for so much less. That wouldn't make any sense. I, well, I guess... Actually, I guess with his high evasion, he could just be getting missed all the time. It's a possibility. Seems unlikely, but it's possible. Who knows with this game, right? That's a different one. Then you want to hurt me, so I don't know. Damned if you do, damned if you don't. Next time on uh, Grimrock, we will continue to try and just get any headway into this room. Uh, in before there's infinite spawners.